Yellow school buses full of excited students were a common sight for the happy hooligans as tours became an everyday occurrence at the base. 119th Wing Public Affairs conducted tours to over 400 students from North Dakota, Minnesota, and South Dakota. Many came from a program called Starbase, a DOD educational program. The students um, come here for five days as a classroom with their classroom teacher, and they study science, technology, math, and engineering. Part of the Starbase curriculum is to spend one of the five days touring a military installation. The Happy Hooligans gave the students a red carpet tour. From flying a simulated MQ-1 Predator on the Predator Mission Air Crew Training System, called PMATS, to the hangar to see a C-21 Learjet and talk to pilots and aircraft maintainers. It's a little harder to breathe and that's why the masks fall down. Does it have an air conditioner in here? Too? There is. The final stop on the tour consisted of the fire hall where eager students had the opportunity to try on equipment, climb in the fire trucks, aim and man a hose putting out simulated fires consisting of traffic cones. That's why the students here at Starbase over a five-day period increased their test scores 35 percent because they can think back because it's something they actually did. It's not just something they watched, it's not just something they read about, but it's something they actually did and they were able to experience. The tour was an excellent opportunity for airmen to meet hundreds of students face to face and show them firsthand what the North Dakota Air National Guard was all about. It's a, it's a great program, it's a great opportunity for these students because the things that they do are all hands-on activities, they're excited about them and the nice thing is we're excited as instructors about these programs so our excitement transfers to those students and they just have a great time and aren't really realizing that they are learning a lot. Of very At the end of the tour, students gathered in the dining hall to eat lunch and watch a liquid nitrogen demonstration. During the demonstration, the instructors poured the liquid nitrogen into a large bowl of ingredients, quickly making ice cream for all the viewers to taste, including the tour guides. It was the best vanilla ice cream I've ever had in my life. <laughs>